For me, uh, education was a, a, a revolutionary experience. Um, you know, I, uh, I often harken back to a quote uh, from H.G. Wells uh, that, that says, civilization is a race between uh, education and catastrophe. Uh, I think, you know, that quote kind of sums up, you know, my entire attitude about education. Uh, it's, it's framed in uh, an incredibly idealistic uh, kind of context. Um, you know, and uh, I guess, you know, in order to contextualize why, why, why is education revolutionary for me? Um, I think uh, when I approached uh, college, higher ed, um, I think I was around 23 years old. I, um, I had just I had gotten out of the Marine Corps. Uh, I worked for General Electric for a year in the corporate world, working in a cubicle. Um, I was, by and large, unsatisfied with life. Uh, you know, had many questions, uncertainties about uh, myself, the world, uh, our, you know, the United States, our position in the world, um, and, and ultimately, you know, I took a bet and went essentially into college because I really had nothing else, really had no other direction. Uh, you know, in, in, in college, it essentially had the ability to, to focus me or to ground me. Uh, you know, so being exposed to academia, being exposed to uh, you know different ways of thinking, being exposed to American history, American politics, um, you know, really just you know it's, it, it politicizes me, and uh, you know, in, in all you know, in all sense, it you know changes my life. Uh, you know, it, it provides me comfort in a incredibly chaotic world. Uh, so, in terms of teaching, I guess that's my experience with education um, when it. In terms of being in the classroom, I, uh, I guess I want to replicate that. Um, I would like to, uh, you know, for people to encounter me, to encounter my classes, to encounter my attitudes, my approach to the world, uh, to who we are as people, as Americans, um, and, and to simply realize that uh, any of those uncertainties that they may have are not unfounded, uh, and that, uh, you know, that's something I deal with, I think it's something all humans deal with, that all Americans deal with. Um, and, I, and I think that education is a way to uh, try to smooth out uh, all those uh, uncertainties. Uh, so in, in teaching, I hope to do that, even though I teach uh, American politics and American history, uh, and that's very focused, very specific. Um, but in the teaching, I, I hope that comes across, that um, you, know, and, and you don't have to be a major in, in American politics or American history, uh, that you can have these questions and that you can attempt to answer them. Uh, and, it, and it's good to have those questions. And, and, uh, so that's why I, I, I teach. Um, when it comes to teaching Cold School, uh, you know, I teach uh, introductory classes. I don't, there is no, you know, history program or political science program. Uh, so I teach, in, you know, for the most part, uh, students who are majored in other fields uh, and uh, you know, are essentially required uh, to take these classes. Uh, some, uh, some teachers may see that as a hindrance. Uh, you know, the fact that I'm dealing with students who really have no inclination and are not going to think about American history after they leave my classroom. Uh, some, may, you know, some teachers may find fault with that. I, I personally enjoy that. Even if I was, you know, had a PhD down the road, I think I would prefer teaching intro classes to a diversity of students uh, instead of teaching classes just to history majors or political science majors. Then, then I want that diversity. I want students from all different backgrounds. I like the fact that uh, it's Cobalt Skill, it's a, it's a rural place. I, I grew up here and from here, yet we have you know, uh, students from all across the state, different countries, etc. cetera. Uh, and I can, I can reach that diversity uh, through teaching uh, introductory classes. Uh, so even though there is no you know, social science kind of focused um, program at SUNY Cobalt Skill, you know, I, I, I enjoy it. I almost appreciate that more so uh, because I can interact with